Hello and welcome to another Void XRC video. Thanks for tuning in. Today I thought I'd just go over my personal favorite RCs that I own. Uh, I figure we'll just get started. The smallest 128 scale right here. I only actually have two 128 scales, so not too much of a choice for my favorite at this um, scale. But the only the other one I have is a drift um, car, and I definitely prefer this little stadium truck to the drift car. Drift car is quite fun, don't get me wrong, but I don't know, I just like the stadium truck a lot more. It handles pretty well. It does have the upgraded um, metal dog bones inside because the plastic ones are just so weak and whatnot. So you can thrash this thing around pretty hard. You know, nice and small, you can take it wherever you go and you know, just need a decently smooth ground and you're good to go. Let's move on to the next one. This is my 124th one of my 124th crawlers. It's my favorite one, definitely. It beats out the um, this one, the Rockstar Basher here, or I guess it's Basher Rockstar. Quite like it a lot, but this just beats it out for me personally. I I don't know. I just I just like it more. I think it crawls slightly better. So yeah, for the 124th, it's definitely my favorite. Going on to the 116th, <clears throat> this would be my favorite 116th buggy here that I have. Done a little bit of crappy body work to you know help get a little more air flow in there because it does get quite warm. Let me just take the body off and check it underneath. So you can see it does have an upgraded um, ESC. Well, I quite enjoy this one quite a lot. It's quite fast. Let's move on to the next one. This is probably one of the most popular vehicles on my channel. I, I like it. You know, I like it quite a lot. Definitely, definitely one of my top ones. I like. I had a decent amount of work done to it. If you've seen any of my conversion videos, you know it's like the, it's the brushless and whatnot. You know all the stuff I've done. But it's definitely one of my favorites. Good size. Um, jumps well. Handles a lot, of, a lot of different terrain quite well for what it is. Still haven't quite fixed up the front suspension the way I want it yet. So I still, I still haven't found the good uh, suspension yet. But hopefully I will sometime. Right, let's move on to the next one. So then I've got two favorites out of my one tenth scale stuff. I got the Wraith, which I absolutely lo love. The Wraith. This was um, one of my first full scale crawlers that I built up. Like it was just a kit, and I built everything up, and I modified it quite a bit. Like I cut off the back part of the cage in here. And, made these body panels on here myself and whatnot. As you can see this is quite dirty. I don't clean it quite enough after I'm having trail runs with it and whatnot. And you should probably clean yours a little bit better than I clean mine. But yeah, I made you know this little gas tank in the back and then this little jerry can. You can see the speed controller is just sitting right there in the back. Got like a little fishing rod little hammer that I made in the toolbox there. I spent quite a lot of time working on this thing as you can, you can probably tell. Let's just have a look under the hood here. You can see that's where I've got the battery. And then there's, there's the um, winch controller and the rest of the electronics are in that little box there. Alright, well let's move on to my final favorite RC. And that is the Desert Fox. I was quite surprised when I realized that this has become one of my favorite RCs. It's definitely beat out both the Quantum Vandal and the Vandal XL. I 
I think one of the major reasons for that, that, sorry, I think one of the major reasons for that is it's got a longer wheelbase than the other two vehicles have. So it, it handles a little bit better, it's a little more stable and whatnot. And um, I just quite like it, it's great for jumping. It, um, it's, it's great for a lot of different things on trails and just messing around, bashing, whatever you need to do. It's good to mount um, FPV gear if you want to do some of that. It's a nice stable platform for that. Um, I just, I don't know, I just really seem to like this for some reason. I'm not quite sure why I like it so much, but I do. So that's my favorite RCs. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.